The Rendlesham Forest UFO incident will be declassified after 50 years, yet strangely, they will not release these files until after the 2017 general election. This information has been withheld from the public by the British government since the 1980s. Many documents, images and some speculate actual video footage was collected by the Ministry of Defense. Apparently, the desk was officially closed down in 2009 because it served no defensive purposes. The British X-Files have been held back by the National Archives in 2013. More information and interviews with the hackers will be published on this channel. Please subscribe to stay updated. The release of UFO files has been pushed back twice after it was initially scheduled for release in March. Why is this happening? Is it really so complicated to show this information? Maybe the files tell of technologies withheld from the people. Technology that could bring down big businesses such as electric and oil companies. I guess losing the trust of the public before the election would not be classed as optional by a political campaign. A campaign that is funded by the very industries who could lose billions. No conflict of interest there then. A spokesman for the National Archives said due to the upcoming election here in the UK and the rules relating to government departments during the election period, the files will not be released until after the election. The spokesman added we are working to ensure that the files are ready for release as soon after this period as is possible, hopefully around the middle of June. When you use a technique of statement analysis on these comments they are quite disturbing. The only reason the files are not ready for release. The government has not yet finished modifying, picking and choosing what the public can and cannot see. This is a pointless battle against such dictatorship. If you have paid for a hamburger with cheese, disappointment arises when a half-chewed piece of cheese with a free and detachable dead mouse is presented. For those who do not know, the Rendlesham Forest incident is one of the most famous of British UFO cases. Referred to by many as the British Roswell. Strange lights were reported near Raff Bentwaters and Raff Woodbridge during a period of three nights between December 26 to the 28th in 1980. It was first exposed on voice recordings from senior American soldiers, who also drew disturbing pictures of the object they saw at the British forest. While in Rendlesham Forest, our security team observed a light that looked like a large disc-shaped eye. Red in color, moving through the trees, Colonel Charles Hald said. After a few minutes this object began dripping something that looked like molten metal. Another claimed to have telepathically received a binary code, which has never been deciphered. Did an alien spaceship land that day? The National Archives maintained that they were a non-ministerial government department, and added that they had made the decision to publish the documents after the election.